What's up guys? Today we are tackling the pineapple. Everybody loves to draw pineapples. Well, not everybody, but I'm guessing you're gonna love it as much as I do. They're fun to draw, they're fun to paint, they're pretty. Um, they mean like welcome into my home, I will take care of you. That's why you'll see them like uh, hotels will have statues of them, blah, blah, blah. Don't need the history of the pineapple. Let's just get to it. So I'm gonna start with pencil, just kind of mapping like my pineapple out because if you just tend to start at the bottom sometimes it gets big and you don't leave enough room for the leaves all right so I want like my top leaf to maybe be there I'm just gonna kind of map it out and then the bottom the actual part that's sweet is here and it's kind of like boxier than you think all right so that should be good now I'm gonna hit the ink. You can stay with pencil the whole time. This just, it's darker for you to see what's going on here, but it's a lot of pressure for me. I can't make any mistakes with this darn pen. Okay, so let's get to it. I always tend to start this side of the pineapple. I don't know why. I'm not making a straight line because pineapples are kind of, you know, ch -ch -ch. they're very prickly, picky. I always have that like saying like, sharp on the outside, sweet in the inside, something like that. So I'm gonna kinda do that kinda like bumpy look. Boom, boom, boom. If there's anything you wanna see me draw or like, you know, something you're just like, hey, I wanna get better at this, send it over because like I'm always up for ideas and I need to broaden my horizons myself. Um, this I kinda make messy at the bottom cause it's like leafy. So you're gonna kinda, you know, not make it look perfect. And then there's the bottom. All right. Okay. We'll add more detail in a moment. Let's add some leaves here. Before I finish this upper one, there's, you know, maybe like a leaf that comes down here. I feel like my pen is not as liquidy as I like. Maybe I need a new one. It's hard to get new equipment these days. So, like, I ordered something on Amazon the other day, and it said it wasn't going to come till like, six weeks but I actually got it in like a week so a little info for you guys I think they say it's going to be longer than it is but anyhow so if you want to order watercolor paints or markers know that it might say it's going to be a long time but it's not that bad okay so we're just adding some leaves um you know think layers maybe the, this one you kind of see the top of it but then it's cut off by this one you could even look at a real pineapple while you're doing this if you have a pineapple at home um, then we have kind of like you'll see like the bottom of it and then you'll see kind of the tip see how I did that so let's do it again together so it kind of comes up but then it like has this line and then it's like folding over so there's a lot of those at the beginning here kind of seeing it and then it's folding over this guy would be fun to paint. I'm going to paint this with you guys. I painted one of the pictures the other day and the video just was bad. Something went wrong with it. It cut off and I don't know what happened. So I had to actually like delete it. I was really heartbroken because it was, it turned out really good. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. Now maybe a couple more like that. Maybe this one's kind of like you bring it to a point like that, but then it's kind of like folded over. You know what I mean? And then sometimes there's these like little hairs that hang. Let's do one of those over here. So like you're gonna see it. Little hairs. All right. Hope you guys are following along okay here. We got kind of like this long one over here. They're pretty hairy at the end of those tips, if you really look. I examined some pineapples one summer because I was drawing them a lot all the time and painting them and I was just kind of like, okay, I really got to learn. It was funny, someone brought up to me the other day, they're like, I've been doing your videos and like, oh my gosh, I look at flowers completely different now. I'm like looking and noticing the folds and this and that and I'm just like, it's so true because when you paint something and draw something, not even a lot, but often, you do start to look at it different because you're kind of like, okay, like I can do that and like you learn from it. So start looking at flowers differently. 
Oh man, I'm weird. Do do do. But weird is okay. Okay, I think this is looking kind of cool. Keep layering that baby. We're gonna have one kind of come up here like this. Yeah, it's all different directions. This thing grows. Okay, doing good. So the leaves, boom, boom, boom. Keep going with them. Um, I'm feeling like that might be enough. Maybe one more up here. This I didn't make a card, but I I did measure the size of like a frame, a four by eight, because I'm like, oh, maybe I'll frame this after and put it in my kids' room. Okay, now let's tackle some lines. Kind of that, you know. A little bit of shadowing, a little bit of lines. I love these pens because when you go in watercolor later, they don't run. They're like waterproof, they won't run on you. So that's good to know if you're looking for pens. It's these guys here. Micron? Micron? I don't know, might be saying it wrong. I botch up. I don't know if that is even the word. That's how bad I am at botching up songs, names of actors, pretty much everything. I'm just like not that bright that way. I might even saying the word botch wrong. That's just like really pathetic. <laughs> Anyhow, you guys love me anyways. La la la. Okay, cool. Now let's get in here. This is where it kind of gets tricky and sometimes I used to get frustrated because these little things like you kind of want them to you know work it's almost like they're like you know they have like one two three four five sides to them you got like the two sides so you got to kind of keep they're somewhat symmetrical if you look at one they kind of go on this like angle this way so i'll kind of like start with one and work its way across and I'm just like sketching it like might not be perfect but I like the look of like an abstracty not so perfect kind of pineapple and if you're a perfectionist this is your time to just like chill out just go with it because you can't always try to be perfect all right Keep going here. Just like these little sections. Boom, boom, boom. So what's new with everybody? Comment, tell me. I guess sometimes there's not much new in this time in the world, but I think a lot of cool things are gonna come out of this whole like isolation. Just different stuff. People are living differently, learning how to make bread, learning how to paint, learning how to draw. I don't know. I see a lot of good. This is kind of big, this guy here. I'm gonna try and make it smaller somehow. All right. So I'm feeling pretty, pretty good about this. This is looking a little bare here. I feel like we need a little more filler. All right. All right. Now we're going to go in and they're kind of like, they got this little like sling going up and then they kind of have like this little, like, it's almost like little stars, you know, those little like prickly things go up. You don't want each one to look the same because they're not on a pineapple. So kind of like have a method, but like change it up each time. Good. And if you have any suggestions for me to make these videos better, someone said the angle is good, so that's good. But if you're like, don't talk so much, or talk more, or I don't know, just please tell me. I won't take it personally. Um, I love constructive criticism. Um, so please go ahead and tell me what I can do to improve, because I want, I'm doing these for you guys. Now, mind you, I did not go to art school, so I don't know exact techniques. 
and terminology. So if you're a super, super technical person, then I might not be for you. I'm not for everybody. And I'm okay with that. Mine's more just like freestyle, no rules. All right, let's add in a little bit of like dots here and there. I just do my own thing. Figure out my own shit. Good. Maybe a little bit of like, you know, shaping a little. Now, like sometimes when you look at pictures, it's like, oh my gosh, I could never draw that. It looks so hard. But you can, like you saw the steps that I did to do this. It wasn't rocket science. It's just tackling one area at a time. All right, let's add in a little, you know, little leaves down here, a little deeper in. Good. I like to like, when it's on a card, sometimes I sign it when it's a card. I add my name, my last name, Chevy Chevalier. And I feel pretty good about this. Maybe a little, you know. Whatever, it's sitting on a table. Boom! Ba da dum bum bum! Go in and erase some of the pencil. Let's watercolor this baby up. I will do that in the next or next or next video. But I will hit it up. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you like this one. A pineapple just for you. Have a great day, guys. Love you. Bye.